All right, guys, your computer is running really slow and you want to fix that. And I want to help you do that. So uh, bear with me here. I'm going to try to move fairly fast through each of these steps. Um, and hopefully we'll be able to get your computer running in tip top shape, just like you, you brought it home from the shop. Anyways, the first problem that might happen is not enough hard disk space. So re reboot your computer, uh, come to computer and then just check right there It'll show it or you can go to properties. It'll show it right there. And then also, you could have um, unused programs. And so you can get rid of those by uh, coming here to Control Panel and then uninstall a program and then just get rid of those programs that you're not using and that you probably won't use in the future. The next thing that uh, could cause problems is corrupt data. Uh, <laughs> data, not date. So uh, just come here to computer again, go to properties, and then you want to go to tools, um, check for the driver errors. It's going to ask you to reboot your computer if you haven't already. Um, and then you can schedule the disk check for when, next time you reboot your computer. It's really easy. It'll do that for you. Next thing is you're going to want to defragment your computer and you want to analyze first and then it'll start analyzing and then defragment and that'll really help your uh, computer run a lot <coughs> computer run a lot faster okay so I hope you're still with me here the next thing you want to do is check for missing updates for your window drivers and uh, make sure you update your drivers so down here all these pop-ups these notifications that always pop up oh it looks like I've got two um, open action center and it'll show uh, any problems that you have if you have an update and you've been ignoring it remember these things are important Make sure you always update uh, your windows. And then also for your drivers, you could be having uh, driver problems. So you wanna go to uh, control panel. You wanna change the category to small icons. This is for Windows 7, remember. And then you want to go to device manager. And then just as an example, we're gonna go ahead and use, um, uh, we use display, we use graphics. You just right click it go to update driver software search automatically for the uh, software and it will do that for you automatically and uh, hopefully it'll come up with it if uh, if it's not updated and it'll update that for you looks like mine's already updated uh, which is nice and if you can't uh, if it doesn't find it online you can search for it yourself by coming here right click go to properties and then you can go to details and you can find out all the information you need to go to the Intel or whatever your graphics card is uh, website and um, manually download and then you go to update driver and then you can find the, the update and then just manually install it really easy and will definitely uh, solve a lot of problems with uh, hardware and slow moving computers next thing uh, overheating computer really easy clean the inside of your computer get a fan for your laptop if you don't have one if it's overheating go it can cause huge problems. You could also have a corrupt OS operating system. And so make sure that you have something, some form of security. Mine is Microsoft Security Essentials, which I think is really good. Make sure you do a full scan every now and then and keep it up to date. Um, looks like mine was checked just a few days ago, so that's fine. Um, it automatically checks. The other thing is bad hardware hardware conflicts, missing hardware. Um, you wanna come back to uh, your hardware area, which again, control panel, uh, device manager, and then I'll use uh, sound as an example. I have all these different sound drivers, and um, you can. this one is from a microphone, this one is for my computer, so I can uh, disable or I can um, enable um, that way I can kind of decide which one that I want to use. Um, and so if you're wondering why you're having problems, they might be interfering with each other. And so you can kind of uh, choose which one you, you want to use there. All right. The next thing is uh, you may have slow boot up. And this is a big problem for people. And this is an awesome fix. Go to MS config. Um, just there in your bar. Go to startup. And then... It's got all these different pro, uh, programs, and uh, I accidentally hit 
uh, disable all when I open this up, so I'll just push cancel. But it's got all these different programs, um, and a lot of these you don't need to pop up every time that you reboot your computer and it slows it down. I think I have maybe these first ones right here um, normally, and so I can go ahead and show you that. So these are the ones that pop up for me. And these are the ones that don't, but if all of these did, it would probably take two to three times longer for my computer to boot up, maybe even longer than that. And so that's how you can uh, speed that up. Anyways, moving on. So another big problem is web browsers or um, third party programs can hijack your homepage, throw a bunch of malware on your computer, spyware, whatever. You wanna remove all toolbars they're no good. All you need really is Google Chrome or Firefox. Um, and so in order to remove the toolbars, you go to, again, uh, computer. I'm going to go ahead, uh, go to open control panel. It's another way to get there. Go back to category, uninstall program, find the toolbar and uninstall it. And then you want to go to your web browser, go to options, and then um, it's pretty easy for every uh, web browser this is for Google Chrome and then home page and then you can kind of decide what you want okay so there's um, how to fix web browser problems uh, and then again scan for malware and then finally use only one security system don't have a whole bunch of anti-spyware programs they interfere with each other and they can cause your computer problems so uh, if you follow all these steps then you should have a definitely a faster running computer and I definitely hope this helped you guys uh, don't forget to subscribe um, and if you have any requests for videos dealing with computers um, I can go ahead and make a video just for you so go ahead and send me a message whatever you need I can uh, I can put that out for you